That'll be four more. Just beating the man at backward cover point. Ijaz taking his time to play himself in. Now he's scoring as quick as Said Anwar. Oh, that's got away. Well, half stopped by Jack Russell. England can't afford that. And so often Cork strays down the leg side. I wonder if that was half a chance. I wonder if he just got a little bit of a leg glance on that. And Jack Russell got his left hand. A very difficult one, low and diving left. Yeah, I think that was uh, just about a chance. Certainly bat, you're quite right. Certainly a... Not but just as we say oh. in Yorkshire, but he just got the glove there. Well, he got the ball to help him. Four runs, he got the full toss on leg stump, which is a gift when you're struggling a bit. Yeah, it was a good attempt, but nothing much the fielder can do with a ball that's drifting down leg. And just walloped it, really, got it on the full toss, as Tony says. And a fine shot. A couple of bounces and a roll. Well placed, nicely timed. Looks like four and is four. 50 for Ejaz. Full of patience and deflections and nudges and prods. But over the last three or four overs, he has some really good shots. And that's driven square of the wicket, it's running down to the third man boundary and it's going to be four runs, 190 for two. And this one's going to be four runs, Hick this time cannot cut it off, first bounce over the boundary line for four, 199 for two. E. Jazz has paced this inning superbly. Once again, he's gone for that gap at wide third man. The bat angled away. And there's an appeal for a catch behind, and he's out. E. Jazz is standing there, but he's out. Caught behind, 214 for three. A very important wicket for England, they're hanging on in there. Ejaz has gone, it's all smiles with the umpire, he just stayed there, waited for the decision. Nearly all players will wait for the umpire's finger, he goes for the drive, thin outside edge, through to Jack Russell. Venkat's finger goes up. Ejaz, an excellent 70 from just 83 balls, Pakistan 214 for 